Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Up Comedy, I'm back with another Dokkan battle video. So today we are jumping back into the legendary Goku event, mainly to test out the two newly awakened blue boys on global, the Fizz Super Saiyan Blue Goku, as well as the Tech Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. Now, for some reason, neither of them are rainbowed. I don't really understand how because I'm 99% sure that I got enough dupes to rainbow them over the course of my Dokkan career. So what I think actually happened is because they were so bad, just like really, really freaking bad before their awakenings, I probably used their dupes to raise the super attacks of other Super Saiyan Blue Gokus and other Super Saiyan Blue Vegetas, like the STR ones, the AGL ones, and so on and so forth. Obviously, a very stupid move on my end. I should have known better. Don't be like me, but it's okay. It's okay because this guy still has three dupes. The Goku still has two dupes. So both of them are still very good. And the rest of the team is a pure Saiyans team. As you can see, my uh, transforming Vegeta. We have a one dupe uh, Namek transforming Goku. We also have a two dupe Easy A Fizz Broly. Of course, rainbowed Vegeta and Trunks. And the friend Fizz Vegeta. That is the team. That is the setup. And without further ado, guys, let's jump in and see what these guys can do. Now, I am very excited to test them out because I've heard some very, very good things about them. This is my first time using them because I just awakened them, just got them to, them to SA10. So, uh, this is definitely a fresh experience for me. So let's see what happens. All right, so we do have a few fizz orbs here. Um, I, I think we can get more though if I actually give... So let's take the Goku adaptation first and I'll put Vegeta here. Let's actually give these to Vegeta. And now we have one, two, three, four, five, six. So six orbs in total. Six orbs here as well, but we want more fizz orbs. Okay, so first things first, Goku has 32,824 defense before any supers are launched, before we get any orbs. Now, if we give him 6 orbs here, his defense goes up to 88,624. Not too bad, not too bad. Now, keep in mind, he does stack defense and attack every single time he supers, so that defensive stat should go up pretty fast. Okay, we're getting supered right off the bat before we had any chance to stack anything. So yeah, Vegeta took quite a bit of damage there. Um, we'll be okay, we'll be okay. Over the course of the, the, the event, after a couple turns, everybody should be able to stack up quite a bit of defense. So um, in the later stages, this team is gonna be really, really tanky. Like I might be able to, you know, I don't even wanna put that out there just in case I don't do it. I was gonna say though, I was gonna say, we might be able to no item this event, um, but now that I say that, I kind of have to do it, right? You know what? I'll try my best, guys, but no promises. If I have to use an item to not die, I'm gonna use the item. So we're gonna attempt a no item run. I still actually haven't no itemed this event even once. I mean, if I really tried, maybe I could, but. Uh, in the past, when I've been doing this event, it's always been a showcase, right? So I'm just like, you know what, instead of trying to no item, I might as well just try to showcase the unit and uh, not die. So today, we're going to try the no item, but if I have to, I still, I'm still going to item, all right? So that, that's what we're going to do. That's the, that's the plan. Okay, so we got some tech orbs changed. We got a few fizz orbs changed, but can't really reach any of those orbs anyways. Um, what should we do here? I'm not really sure. I don't want to put the two um, Super Saiyan Blues together because they're constantly going to be stepping on each other's toes. Like one guy's going to change the tech orbs and then Goku's going to come in and change those tech orbs to phase orbs. So they're never really going to be able to work together too well. Um, hmm, let me think about this. Well, if I put Vegeta here... Actually, it doesn't even look like anybody's going to be able to get their supers off. Uh, <laughs> that really, really sucks, guys. That really sucks. Okay, so just a terrible rotation, a terrible board of orbs. Uh, at the very least, the Fizz Vegeta can super. And Goku cannot super either. Yeah, this is really bad rotation. It's like the worst rotation possible. 
I just hope we don't get supered this turn. If you're gonna super me, man, super me next turn, please. Um, <laughs> or at least super the Vegeta in the middle. All right, Vegeta in the middle can eat some damage right now. Oh my god, Goku's getting supered. Goku's getting supered, and we're taking 138k, but on the bright side, on the bright side, we got the transformation for Namek Goku really, really early. So he's going to be able to stack defense for a long time, um, which is good, which is good. So what should we do here? Um, I think I'm actually going to keep the Goku... You know, I kind of want him to take hits, but at the same time, he doesn't have a lot of defense right now. 72k. Um, let's well, screw it. We're just gonna we're just gonna go with this. I, I don't I don't really know why, but it feels right, so we're gonna go for it. Uh, I think normal attacks still aren't gonna do that much damage to us. 16k. Yeah, whatever. It's all good. And uh, we're getting 1.7 mil. That super attack animation still one of my favorite in the game. Actually, all of this guy's animations, all of them. Every single one, his uh, pre-transformed Super Attack the Spirit Bomb, his transformation animation, his uh, post-transformation Super Attack, that Kamehameha, that uh, active skill when he goes like angry. Every single animation from the Namek transforming Goku, I absolutely adore. So uh, yeah, I had to bring him. Even though we're trying to showcase the Super Saiyan Blues, I had to bring this Goku because just like every excuse I have to use him, I'm gonna use him. Okay, so now uh, we have quite a few tech orbs. I love it. Uh, we're definitely not gonna be exchanging the Vegeta for the rest of the fight. Um, as far as Vegeta goes though, the tech one, let's actually put this guy here. Ooh, you know what? If we give him orbs, he's gonna have a lot of defense, so I shouldn't have to worry too much about him there in the first slot. So 38,000 defense right now, but if we give him these orbs here, he goes up to 148,000 defense. So quite a jump from before. And uh, we can give these to him, and uh, he can take a few more as well. So. I'm not too worried anymore guys, 76 damage, 108 damage, and our attack goes up to almost 2 million. Almost 2 million, almost killed the Goku, not quite, but this will finish him off. And now we're going to move on to the Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Man, considering how many times I've done this event, I still don't fully remember the different stages. Uh, no! Wow, I was wrong. Okay, now we're on Super Saiyan 2 Goku. My bad, guys. All right, Super Saiyan 2 Goku, uh, the tech form. And let's see, we can, we can actually get a lot of Fizz orbs here. So I think I'm going to keep the two Gokus in rotation. And give these to the Fizz Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Let's see what his defense is at. 133,000. Very, very respectable. And there we go. We should be fine. I don't think my Fizz Vegeta will take too much damage at the end there but we'll see in a second we'll, we'll be we'll be sure in a second all right we're, we're taking a super 133,000 defense we're taking 56k i can live with that i can live with that that that's fine that's fine now we're gonna enjoy this amazing animation once again oh, it's just so clean guys it's just so clean i love it i love it you know i've, I've gone back and forth about like favorite animations in the game. Um, at one point it was AGL cooler, metal cooler. Uh, at one point it was the new transforming cooler. Yo, someone at Bandai really loves cooler, man. Cause he always gets like the best animations. Even the Fizz cooler, the 120 lead. At the time when he came out, he had one of the better animations in the game, right? So coolers just always in general have really, really nice animations. Um, but that being said, yeah, it used to be him at one point, the, the AGL cooler, it used to be the STR cooler at one point, it used to be, uh, what else? Um, I'm trying to, I'm trying to think. Well, I mean, <laughs> I, the, the point is, the point is, I've had a lot of different phases for favorite animations, but I always come back to this Namek Goku, man. No matter, like, which new unit comes out with an amazing animation, I enjoy it for a while, and then I always come back, guys. I always come back to the Namek transforming Goku. I don't think anybody is gonna like 
replace him forever. There's gonna be new units here and there. I'm gonna be like, yo, that's cool animation. I enjoy that animation. But at some point or another, I'm gonna come back to the Namek Goku. So I'm gonna just say this right now in this video. Uh, Namek transforming Goku will always be the unit with my favorite animations in the game. No matter how many amazing animations come out in the future, no matter how cool the units are, at the end of the day, it's always going to be Namek Goku. Okay, let's focus on the gameplay. I don't know why I went on this like random tangent <laughs> in the middle, just out of nowhere. Uh, ooh, we can active skill. We can active skill. Do I want to active skill though? I don't think so. I don't think I really feel like active skill. No, I don't think we should. So I'm going to give these orbs to the Fizz Goku. 110,000 defense, not a lot, but not a little either. And we're gonna no item it here. I don't like using items until, like, if I have to, I don't like to use them until at least the Super Saiyan Blue. Um, if I can hold off, I'd prefer to hold off until Super Saiyan, or rather, uh, STR UI Goku. And of course, if we can, the best case scenario is to no item. But like I said, I'd, I'd rather not die. <laughs> than trying to no item and dying in the middle of the showcase, right? That would just be too annoying, man. After recording for almost 12 minutes already, having to go back and re-record is just not a fun time, guys. It, it would not be a fun time. Okay, so now we're getting the double Vegeta transformation. Uh, I guess we have to give the Fizz Orbs to Vegeta right now because it would just be way too disrespectful to him if we don't. So, all right, fine. I'll give these orbs to the Fizz Vegeta. He put in all that work to change them. We're gonna heal up back to a good amount. Of, not not full, but a good amount. And no tech orbs for the Super Saiyan Blue Tech Vegeta, but 130,000 defense nonetheless. Not too bad. And I'm just gonna pray that we don't get supered in that final slot. As long as we don't get supered there, we're good to go. 3.7 million. I always love to see that attack stat after we get the full board of orbs, it's so nice. And we're critting for 2.8, and we're getting supered here, I should be okay. Uh, 55k, totally fine, totally fine. 1.4 mil, almost 1.5 from the Tech Vegeta. I love that lean back he does. <laughs> I love that lean back he does in his super attack animation. Um, it's just so random, it's just so random, like why are you leaning like that? Vegeta, why are you leaning like that? It just makes no sense, but I like it, I like it. Okay, so now we can actually get a Dokkan attack off. Um, hmm, I'm trying to think what makes the most sense here. I think actually, I mean, we can't actually super with Goku, but we can get a bunch of Fizz orbs here. So the Dokkan attack, I guess, is going to go to the Fizz Super Saiyan Blue Goku. I mean, we can't avoid it. Uh, the orbs just kind of worked out that way. We were kind of forced to do this. So, all right, fine. Take the Dokkan attack. I'm gonna try to not screw this up. I screw this up all the time. So we're gonna focus here. One, two, three, four, five, six, boom. That was actually really fast too, but we got it. We're good. Let's see how much the attack. Uh, 1.38 mil, not the craziest, not the craziest. We didn't get a lot of orbs, but uh, respectable. Respectable, for sure. Can we get a crit? No crit, he's still dead, doesn't really matter. Moving on now, guys, to Super Saiyan God. I got that one right. Super Saiyan God Goku. Okay, um, that is a crap ton of attacks. So, <laughs> damn, dude. Should I put him... Hmm, yeah, I'm a little bit worried right now about... Well, if we put the Fizz Vegeta in the middle, he has 171k defense. So he should be okay to take all those attacks. Uh, Tech Vegeta has 100 and, oh, 99. Yo, I should've put him in the middle. Damn, it's fine, it's fine. Either way, I mean, it's not a huge difference, 199K, 171K, but the Fizz, or the Tech Vegeta does have more defense than the Fizz one. So that was a bit of a misplay. My apologies, over 2 million attack now from Vegeta. Um, one amazing thing, of course, about both the, the Fizz Vegeta, or sorry, the, the, I keep getting the types mixed up right now, the Fizz Goku and the Tech Vegeta, the two newly awakened blue uh, units, is that they both 
stack, attack, and defense infinitely every single time they super, that still did a lot of damage to us, holy crap. Um, they both stack infinitely, so they're both extremely, extremely good for this event, and in the long term, this team is probably gonna get, like, so tanky that it's just invincible. Like, I, I don't expect to take a lot of damage right now, we're still taking damage. Right now we're still hurting, but in the like final two stages, I don't think we're going to be taking that much damage. Just because of how damn tanky these guys are. Okay, you know what? I can't, I can't do this. Uh, <laughs> I, I really want to give the orbs to my Vegeta, but I have to give them to the Goku. I have to. Like, there, there's no choice. So, so, I'm sorry Vegeta, man. I know you worked so hard to change the orbs, but... I can't resist. So all these orbs are going to my 2 dupe Fizz Super Saiyan Blue Goku. He has 466,000 defense now <laughs> with a full board of Fizz orbs. Uh, absolutely brilliant. I enjoy that. Okay. And uh, I mean, you can still super. You can still super. So at the very least, we're not completely shafting him. So we're not taking any damage here. And our attack goes up to 4 million. With the crit, no crit, with the additional, yes, oh, oh, no, I saw the attack stat, I was like, yo, that's a really high attack stat, that must be an additional super, but no, because we had so much attack, so many orbs, uh, the normal attack was 1.5 mil, okay, that's fine, that's fine, no problem, no problem at all, uh, the Goku tanking really well too, our STR Namek Goku, and uh, yeah, we're, we're making short work of this stage, man, we literally, that was the first turn, right? I think that was the first turn, and he's almost dead. Okay. Um, I think we should actually stack with Broly a bit more. Uh, let's see how much defense the tech Vegeta gets right now with those orbs. 224k. Okay. Okay, he's fine. He is just fine. We're going to take the Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, the, the Fizz 1, out of rotation here because he doesn't stack defense anymore. So we're going to focus on just stacking our stackers. For the rest of this event. Here we go. <laughs> the Alien Vegeta, oh my god. Alright, 544k. We haven't seen any additional supers on the Vegeta and the, the Goku yet, which is actually really annoying. I, I gave these guys more additional than crit, which goes against pretty much what I do for most units, but for these guys, I wanted them specifically for this event to get additional supers, and it's not happening right now. That's a little frustrating, guys. Oh my god, Broly's getting supered. I mean, we got three supers off in a row and we're still taking 184k, why? <laughs> oh my god, that is still so much damage, even after all those supers. That's the problem with Broly, man. He stacks, obviously, he's, he stacks a lot as well, like he's, he's constantly doing supers, but it's just his base defense is so low. He starts off with such low defense that uh, it takes him quite a bit of time to actually get up there. All right, um, let's put this Vegeta at the end and let's give these orbs to our Super Saiyan Blue Goku, 223,000 defense. I think he'll be okay. I think he'll be okay. The only concern right now is definitely the Vegeta and Trunks. They haven't had a lot of opportunities to build up their defense. So uh, let's hope the Super doesn't go there. 1.8 mil, really nice animation too for this one. Um, both both the Vegeta, like both the awakenings, the Goku and Vegeta, both look really good. And of course, you guys know. I don't have to say anything about Bergamo. You guys know about Bergamo. His animation is great, but <laughs> he's so much more than that, right? It just 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 the unit is ridiculous. It's just such a ridiculous unit. These two are really really good. Don't get me wrong. Whoa. 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 Uh. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. Um. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. How much is gonna is this gonna heal us up by? Mm, not not a small amount, but also not a lot. Uh. I think we can still get away with not using items, though. I, I think we can still get away with not using items. I mean, provided we don't get supered again. 
if we get supered again on like Broly or something, then we're completely screwed. You know, if, if Broly gets supered, then we're completely screwed. I, I think I was talking about something, I just totally forgot after I saw that damage though, I'm just like, dude, I might be dead here. Thankfully we didn't die. I think Broly after these two, two supers should be- oh wow, our phone's almost dead. <laughs> okay, hopefully we finish this before the phone dies. Um, just so many things going on right now, man. So many things going on. Phone's dying, we're dying in the game. Um, <laughs> and I forgot what I was talking about before. I, I know I was talking about something before we took that hit, but it's gone now. It's gone now. Maybe you guys can remind me in the comments down below, or maybe I'll remember as I'm editing this video, but right now I don't remember. I guess it doesn't really matter right now either way. Uh, we're just going to try to finish this event before the phone dies. Um, should I use the active skill here? I don't think we need to. I don't think we need to, because I think this uh, Fizz Goku actually is going to finish him off. 267,000 defense, 180k from uh, STR Goku, pretty good as well, and 3 orbs for the Fizz Vegeta. Yo, super me. I dare you. Super me right now. 2 million. If we crit, he's dead. If we don't crit, he's not dead. <sighs> and of course, of course, the normal attack had to be the crit. It couldn't be the super to kill him. It had to be the normal attack. That was the crit. I mean, it is what it is. Ooh, double super. Double super. I dig that. I'll take it. I'll take it. And that's going to do it. All right, moving on now to UI. STR UI Goku. Um, all right, can we get some tech orbs? We cannot get some tech orbs. Okay, thank you. Uh, I appreciate that. We, we, we have to item here, guys. I think we have to item here. I'm going to use the Princess Snake. Just because, I mean, if we had a lot of tech orbs, I would have felt a lot nicer about it. And we also have the type disadvantage with the Broly. Like, there's just so many things to worry about here. Um, we can only give him two tech orbs, which still brings his defense up to 137,000, but not quite enough to make me feel safe. So the Princess Snake was definitely the smart choice. I think a super here is still probably going to do over 100k to us. And a measly 967,000 attacks that right there, very sad. Um, did go up a little bit, almost a million now with the additional super, and of course he dodges it. Of course he dodges it. Alright, let's see what a super does here. I know, I, I, I'm feeling like he's gonna super me this turn, and there it is. Uh, 113k, so with no Princess Snake, we were 110% dead. There was no question about that. No question about that. Plenty of supers from uh, Fizz Broly. The triple super. That is the second or third time he's done that. I love this unit, guys. Oh my god, and the crits. And the grids. <sighs> Alright. Well, I mean, we've had a few scares here. But overall, we've been okay. Overall, we've been doing doing pretty good. Um, I might not have to use another item for the rest of the run. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. The, the only issue is we have so many... So many Fizz units, right? We have at least one, two, three, four. Four Fizz units. No, is that four? No, three. My bad. No, four. Yeah, four. <laughs> Can't count. Four Fizz units on the team. So a lot of type disadvantage here, uh, which is scary, guys. It's it's very, very scary, especially with that super doing like a bajillion damage to us. Um, okay, so let's put this guy here. And we're only giving him four orbs, but he should still have 173,000 defense, so not too bad. And uh, these ones for Vegeta. Should I pop another item? I'm going to... I'm going to pop an Icarus. Right, I'm, I'm trying to be safe. I'm trying to be safe. I don't know if there's another super coming. If there's not, then that was a waste of an Icarus. But if there is a super coming, then it's better safe to be sorry. That's that's my that's my saying, man. That's why I never do no items, right? Because like even in situations where I can no item, I just elect not to, right? Like I just, I just rather would not risk it if I can. So <laughs> that's why, like if you guys want to see no item runs, there's plenty of them out there. Go over to... Uh, my boy Truth, go over to 
my boy Mass Ninja and so on and so forth. I mean, I can't name all of them, so my bad if I miss people, but it's a lot of guys out there that love to do no item runs. It's just not my thing. It's not my thing. It gives me too much anxiety. <laughs> I'm, I'm not built like that, guys. I'm not built like that. I'm the kind of guy that likes to take it safe. Uh, safety first, obviously protection, very important. I don't know what we're even talking about anymore, but um, yeah, getting back to getting back to the showcase, getting back to the showcase. So one, two, three versus one, two. Okay, so actually more orbs on this side, I believe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. But we have four tech orbs versus three. So how does the math work out there? So it's 80 plus 90, 470. This is um, 120 plus 40, 460. So I think this is still better. Does my math check out? I don't even know. <laughs> my, <laughs> my math might or might not have checked out. I don't really know. We're just gonna we're just gonna go with it. We're gonna roll with it. And here we go. So, oh, I think I actually put a, should have put Vegeta in the middle. Because there's more attacks, I think, in the middle than the first slot. And now we're going to face all those type disadvantage attacks with Broly. Oh, man. Oh, man. Was that a, was that a mistake? That was, that was a huge mistake. That was probably a huge mistake. We do have Icarus active, though, still, I think. So, uh... We'll be okay, I think. Will we be okay? There's the super. I knew it was coming. Under 63. Yeah, we're still okay. We're still okay. It was a little rough. It was definitely a little rough. But um, Icarus saved us. That that would have been death if we didn't have Icarus. That's for sure. But we survived. We survived. And I think we can actually heal up quite a bit here. Uh, let's go. Let's see. Yeah, let's go with him in the front, given these orbs we can actually heal a bit. Um, heal a lot, actually. And, um, wow, we actually cannot... I, I, I'm going to pop the Whis again. So, the second second last stage is definitely the scariest for this team. Because we have so many Fizz types. After we get to the MUI Goku, uh, it's going to be fine. Like, I'm not going to be worried at all. It's just before we get there... It's kind of scary, but uh, we're almost there. Like, he's almost done. He's almost done. And our phone is currently at, let's see, 12% battery. We have 12 more percent to kill this guy and then get to MUI. And uh, when it gets to 5% battery, I think it goes into power saving mode. So I don't really know how that's, that's going to affect the video. I really hope it doesn't change anything, but <sighs> we'll see. We'll see. Ah, <sighs> okay, still got the Whis active right now, which is great. Um, let's see what I should do as far as these guys go. Maybe I should put Broly in the beginning. Uh, yeah, he's gonna auto super anyways, right, because of his passive. He gets plus four key, yeah, yeah, so he's, he's gonna auto super. And we can actually give a ton of orbs to the tech Vegeta here, which is phenomenal. So 371,000, 371,000 uh, defense at the moment. All right, so Broly's taking, oh, Broly's gonna super. Wow, all right. Um, I wasn't really sure actually how that was gonna work. Yeah, no, I don't know why in my mind I thought that we we're gonna bypass the Broly because he doesn't have the full super yet, but that doesn't make sense because he gives himself the key and then he, he launches the super, so. It totally makes sense for him to do the Dokkan attack. It's just in my mind, like it, it didn't work out that way. Let's hope it's a it's a crit though. It's not a crit, okay? It's not a crit. At least we're getting the additional super. 1.7 mil. Give me a third super right here. Okay, not a third super, but uh, decent damage nonetheless. Decent damage nonetheless. 112k from the UI super, but we're gonna heal that up right quick after this turn. 2.6 mil from Vegeta. No crit there. No additional. Yeah, what am I giving you additionals for, man? What am I giving this guy additionals for? He never additionals. <laughs> it's so annoying. And now we're at 10% battery. Oh my god. 10% battery. Why is it draining so fast? Why is there so many things going on in this video besides the actual, actual run? 
right, all right, all right. Okay, so you heal us up, and he has 266,000 defense now. Uh, you just get a crap ton of orbs for 403,000 defense, and uh, at least he can super. Is this turn gonna be it? Can we take care of him this turn? It's gonna be close, I think, if we get some crits going. Uh, if not, then he's still he's still he's still gonna be close to death. I think at the very least we can finish him off next turn. Look at that, 2.7 million attack. Ah, so good, so good. And two mil from the friend Vegeta. Unless he crits here, it's not gonna do much. Uh, yeah, this is the tough one, man. The next stage should be like super super simple. Like just just. Yeah, I'm, I'm expecting the next one to be extremely, extremely fast. It's just this one's gonna take us, it's, it's taking us forever. Uh, where are we at? 315k? Okay, I can, I can do, I can deal with that. I can deal with that. Um, and I guess I give him the int orb so we can save the tech ones for Vegeta next turn. I guess we're not coming back next turn. I mean, ideally, we just finish him off this turn. If if Broly just does some crits, he has like a 40% chance to crit on his passive now, right? So if he just just gives me some crits, it shouldn't do too much. Yeah, 56k, that's fine. We have no items active right now, by the way, guys. The the items all wore off. So currently, we're just uh, going in raw. <laughs> You know what I mean. Um, no protection, no items protecting us, protecting us right now. 75 damage, normals, uh, totally okay. That's okay. That's okay. And the final burst cannon, 202,000, 22,000 defense, or did I say defense damage? Uh, let's see what we can do here. I'm definitely gonna attack with the Goku first. Heal up a little bit. Uh, I guess I'll give him one orb. And uh, even with one orb, still still 136,000 defense. And now I think this is it. I hope this is it. We've been sitting here for too long with this one stage, guys. This this guy's taking me like the last 10 minutes, and now we're at 9% battery. Only only 9% battery. Only probably like five minutes worth of battery to be real before the phone dies. And if the phone dies before the showcase ends. I'm gonna, be, I'm gonna be pissed, man. I'm gonna be really pissed. So, we better finish this fast. We better finish this quick. <sighs> Can I super? Oh my god. We're still alive somehow. <laughs> We're still alive somehow. The normal's gonna do 24k. Ooh, wow. Wow, dodged a freaking bullet there, guys. Dodged a freaking bullet. What's his defense at now? 311k. Okay, he can definitely survive. I'm not going to use another item this turn. Um, I don't think we have to. But we got pretty close there. That was the closest we got so far. And now he's dead. Alright, so note to self, don't bring so many Fizz units on team, making it more balanced so we don't struggle, especially on the final couple stages, like don't bring too many phase units, don't bring too many, I mean I guess for the purpose of this showcase I had to, but uh, maybe I should have brought like an SSBE as one of the leads or something like that, but I wanted to see a good amount of damage from the Super Saiyan Blues, so that kind of was my reasoning. Anyways, we're here, we made it, we made it, we're okay. Um, I'm gonna put this guy here, give him these orbs, and see him get a really good amount of defense. Uh, we're gonna heal up as well, actually, with the Android 8, so the defense will be even crazier now. What we're looking at, what are we looking at? Um, 518,000 defense from Fizz Goku. Uh, STR Goku has 465,000 and 215,000 from Goku and Vegeta, or sorry, Vegeta and Trunks. Still pretty respectable, still pretty respectable. And now just watch us do no damage, or take no damage, and do a lot of damage to UI if he doesn't dodge this, which he does not. Thank you. Thank you. Come on. What are we at? 8%? 8% battery. 8% battery. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh. 
nervous, guys. I'm nervous. This is probably the most nerve-wracking run I've ever done. And not because... I mean, partly because, yeah, we came really close to death, but also more so because it, it, it's accentuated by the fact on my phone that my phone is like literally on the brink of dying. Like, we're at 8% battery right now. 8% battery. Okay. Um, obviously, tech type not ideal, but if we actually just take some of these tech orbs, he still has oh, 636,000 defense with the Android 8. So yeah, I'm not worried about him. I'm really not worried about him. And then all these int orbs can go to my Fizz Vegeta for a good amount of a boost right there. Uh, 2.3 million. 2.3 mil? Ah, oh, he dodged it! Okay, he dodged the normal, I mean, he dodged the super, but he doesn't dodge the additional, of course. <sighs> what could I have expected? And he dodges that too. Come on, man. Take at least one of these. Oh, oh my god. That was a lot of damage. We just lost there. We don't have time for this guy's 7% battery now. 7% battery now. <sighs> Alright, and he's supering us, taking forever with that long ass animation. My god. Okay, um, you go to the end, you take all these Fizz Orbs and just have a stupid amount of defense, 555,000. Yeah, I think he's good. I think he's good. And, um, no super here, but still, you know, he has a good amount of defense, so I'm not gonna item here. Uh, 3.2 million! 3.2 mil! Ah, oh, so good. 1.4 mil, he didn't dodge that. The additional was 1.6 mil. So, uh, <laughs> wow, pretty sweet, 1.8 mil here from Goku, I don't know why I keep reading out all the attack stats, but, um, I think I just need to say things, man, I'm just like really nervous about this run right now, we got 6%, okay, we're still at 7%, still at 7%, every, every single time I check, I expect it to, like, drop a percentage, but we're still good here, still good here, still a lot of HP on the, a lot of HP on the Goku, though. Uh, which is not good. Uh, 462,000 defense, so that's... Uh, he, he should still be able to tank a lot of attacks here. Uh, the Vegeta and Trunks, I think, is still somewhat tanky at the moment. Although, I, I, I'm not too keen on them getting supered here either. So, I'm hoping the super attack is going to be in the middle here. Alright, he's taking that one. 1.4 mil. Additional super almost we're almost at 2 million per super now. He's taking that one too. Another crit. Okay, please super me here. Please give me the super here. <sighs> Alright, that's fine, that's fine. We're building some defense here with the super. We're stacking a little bit of defense. And okay, he's okay, here it is. Here it is. 200k? 250? Something like that. 250. Wow, I was almost right. Like, uh, what's the expression? Like, nail on the head? Like, we almost had it perfect. Alright. Here we go. Uh, this is probably the best option here. What are we looking at? What are we looking at? 473,000. Uh, no STR orbs for Goku. That's fine. He's gonna heal us up a bit. And now, we're going to power saving mode. Uh, on screen though, it still looks good. The screen, like my, my screen, my physical screen went dim, but the Elgato capture still looks pretty good right now. So I think we're we're still fine. I think we're still fine. Um, <laughs> yeah, five percent battery now, guys. Five percent battery. The animation doesn't look like it's actually, uh, you know, lost any quality or frames from what I can see. So I think it's only a change like in real life right now for the gameplay so we're gonna keep going we're gonna keep it going we're doing good so far uh, he's gonna dodge that one that's okay we still got five percent battery guys still got five percent battery <laughs> here we go change some tech orbs vegeta let's go that's not a lot um hmm, okay 
So why don't I actually put Broly here and give him these? And can we get more tech orbs this way? We can get a few more this way. So now he's at uh, 473,000. So definitely much better. And we're not we're not gonna item this this turn either. Uh, this is a very good rotation for sure for this specific stage, right? Like the Broly, even though he doesn't have a ton of defense right now, we're we're almost 200,000 now. So decent amount, but still not a lot. But because we have the type of advantage. We're good to go, and because this guy's building so much defense with every super, um, yeah, we're good. We're good, man. MVP of the of the run. MVP of the run. I mean, the tech Vegeta and the Fizz Super Saiyan Blue Goku, they both did great. Don't get me wrong, they're both doing great. They both have done great things for me, but uh, Broly's the MVP here. Broly is definitely the MVP here. He's like he's he's a unit that it, it just seems like they purposely made for the legendary Goku event, you know. So um, you can't really fault the other guys. Okay, so you go there. Um, we're gonna get a Dokkan attack here with the Goku, three hundred fifty-four thousand defense, very respectable. Uh, let's see, Namek Goku has three hundred seventy-four thousand defense, so that's very respectable as well. And let's focus on this Dokkan attack. I mean, we're gonna get some attacks in here. He's not going to do anything to us. Even a super at this point is going to do double digits, maybe triple digits at the most. We're at 4% battery now. 4% battery now. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Boom. Yo, we are killing it with the Dokkan attacks today. These Dokkan attacks have been on point. And uh, 1.9 million attack, guys. 1.9 million at the moment. If we get a crit, he could be dead. Just give me the crit. Let me finish it. Ooh, no crit. Okay. So Namek Goku is going to finish this one off, guys, with the absolutely glorious Kamehameha animation in your face. And we're ending off with a 1 million crit. Good way to end it. You know what? I would have preferred one of the Super Saiyan Blues to do the job, but hey, that's okay. We finished it. That's all that matters. So that's going to do it for the run today, guys. You know what? I was expecting to... Uh, not come so close to death a couple times but at the end of the day all that matters is you finished it and uh, we didn't use too many items i think i used three right three or four probably probably didn't have to use the fourth one but just be safe like i said better safe than sorry here's protection guys and uh <laughs> that's gonna do it so there's the team the goku and the vegeta two amazing awakenings global first awakenings mind you i'm gonna bring that up every single chance i get um because global just doesn't get a lot of things first you know so don't mind me don't mind me it's just uh just me and my global uh pride showing right now so there it is guys that's the run let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about these two units if uh you guys haven't tested them out yourself and uh if you guys haven't awakened them yet since the update since the uh data download um and you know, you've been thinking about whether or not they're worth it. I think this video should answer your question. Both the Super Saiyan Blue Goku and the Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta are definitely worth it. They're not as good as Bergamo. I mean, few units are, but they are both very, very good in their own right. So go awaken them, go get them to SA10. They're totally worth it. Farm them up and uh, have fun with them. So that's it, guys. Uh, as always, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.